Hi, I'm Zerard from Raptors Republic, and today we're going to look at a few things Kyle Lowry does on the court that are extremely simple but brilliant and have a huge impact on the Raptors' offense. Let's take a look at the action. What's special about this one is that it's off a made basket, which usually results in you entering your half-court set, except Lowry does not relent. He pushes the ball up the court, and he has Jalen Brown on him, but the Celtics are in sort of this switchy zone defense, and he recognizes that, and he traverses a little further ahead and sees Williams on him, which is immediately a mismatch. He recognizes this, pulls back, and takes him straight to the rim for two. This is just good recognition of the situation that's developing on the floor and not just going into the half court just because the other team scored. Four things to note on this play. First, watch that initial burst by Lowry. He easily could have dribbled this ball up the court, but he pushes it up and then passes it to Fred. And as soon as he does that, the Celtics collapse on Fred. And Fred very knowingly knows that Lowry's trailing, passes the ball back to him. At this point, the Celtics defense is out of sorts and Lowry is excellent at finding that seam. Here he does it again for two easy points. This is just Lowry reading on a tell from Williams. As he's bringing the ball up the court, he sees him make eye contact basically with Williams and knows that if he drives to the left, they will double, especially after using the screen, which they do exactly, and the shovel pass back to Surge for the wide open three. The Celtics' defense hardens the more time you give it to set, and Lowry knows that. Even after made baskets, he will try to push the ball up the court and try to probe just to see what's there. Here, you got Tatum and Brown both on him. A little drive is all you need to punch a little hole in there, kick it out back to Surge for the three. Passing up a good shot to get a great shot is a skill, as this clip shows. The Raptors move the ball around well, and at this point right here, Lowry has a clean look. That is an uncontested shot which he can make, except that him and Fred have played together for long enough at this point that he knows there's a better shot out there because two guys are running at him. He'll fake them out, pass it back to Fred, in rhythm, three. This play is pretty unremarkable on the service, but the moment of magic really happens right at this point. There's a triangle developing here between Norm, Fred, and Lowry. But the question is, how do you get a clean look out of it? How do you get that numbers advantage? Two Celtics in the middle and the triangle. That's a three on two for the Raptors. How do you get a clean look out of it? Fred and Lowry have to communicate that. And they do it at this spot right here where Fred will come out, which will force the Celtics to pick which two of Norm, Lowry and Fred they want to guard. They pick Norm and Lowry. Fred is wide open for the three. This is just Lowry creating the shot by going to his left, allowing the Fred's the space to come out, and then making the pass back to Fred. There you have it. Kyle Lowry's simplicity and brilliance all at the same time. If you'd like to see me cover some specific aspects of the game, let us know in the comment section or on YouTube, or just email us at raptorsrepublic at gmail.com. And make sure to hit the subscribe button on YouTube. Goodbye.